You might think the electric race is reaching its peak, but hold that thought. Elon Musk just dropped a bombshell that's sending shockwaves through the industry. We aren't talking about a facelift. We're talking about a revolution, a new motor slated for 2026 that threatens to reset the game and put every other automaker to shame. You see, the battle isn't just about range or batteries anymore. It's about a piece of tech that could render the competition obsolete. Leaked reports came a picture of a machine that is lighter, leaner, and terrifyingly efficient. Imagine a drive unit so advanced it makes cars 40% cheaper and faster, blurring the line between electric power and power petrol performance. But the real secret isn't on the spec sheet. It's hidden deep inside the engineering, a mystery that could spell the end for traditional engines. Is this the checkmate Tesla needs to rule the board again? Before we crack the code, make sure you've hit that like button and subscribed to Drivexa. You need to be here for what comes next. Rewind the clock for a second. You remember the days when electric meant impractical, when the roar of a combustion engine was the only sound of power? They laughed then. They believed a battery could never beat the pump. But while the world clung to the noise, Musk made a choice. He declared the future wouldn't scream, it would just perform. That vision didn't just build a brand, it broke the mold. Fast forward to today, and it's not just a company, it's a conquest. 1.8 million units on the road by 2024. From the Model 3 to the Y, Tesla isn't just participating, they're dominating markets from the US to China. You're looking at a world where nearly one in every five EVs carries the T badge. But it's deeper than sales, it's the cells. With the 4680 technology pushing ranges to 800 kilometers, they've left range anxiety in the dust. And it doesn't stop at the bumper. From Texas to Shanghai, gigafactories are churning out the future at a fraction of the cost. Solar, storage, massive systems, Tesla is building the grid, not just the car. It's a relentless march toward efficiency. But with this new 2026 motor lurking in the shadows, the question remains, is anyone else safe? Keep it locked right here on Drivexa, because the answers might just surprise you. While the competition scrambles to find their footing, Tesla is already running a different race. You don't just buy a Tesla anymore, you subscribe to an experience. It's the silent glide, the magic of autopilot, and the screen that feels like a portal to the future. You go to sleep and software updates transform your ride overnight. But Musk isn't stopping at premium, He's gunning for universal. The target is 2026, the mission, a car that hits the wallet just like a gas guzzler, but performs like a spaceship. When that price parity hits, it won't just be a new model, it will be the new global standard. So what makes this future tick? Let's crack open the hood. Musk calls the new motor the beast, and trust me, it earns the title. This isn't an upgrade, it's a total reinvention. Designed from scratch, every core and wire has been engineered to defy limits. The first rule of speed? Lose the drag. Traditional motors rely on heavy metal frames that anchor the car down. Tesla ditched the iron for a lightweight composite structure. Stronger, leaner, and significantly lighter. By cutting the fat, they've boosted efficiency by 15%. The motor doesn't just spin, it glides, requiring less energy to deliver the same rotational force. Then comes the torque. You might think power requires massive energy consumption, but Tesla flipped the script. This system delivers more punch with less drain. Whether you're climbing a steep incline or blasting down the highway, the motor stays hungry for speed but light on the battery. We're talking about cutting power loss by 40%. Every unit of energy is squeezed for maximum motion. That means you get more range and sharper response without the waste. But even the best engines have an enemy. Heat. Friction kills performance, but Tesla has an answer. They call it the thermal miracle. Imagine a liquid-cooled network that manages temperature at a microscopic level, instantly neutralizing heat before it builds up.
It's a 30% reduction in thermal stress. Your car runs longer, harder, and cooler, extending the lifespan of the machine itself. And here is the kicker. This motor thinks. Equipped with AI-controlled sensors, it constantly monitors speed, temperature, and magnetic fields. If it detects some micro-spike in friction, it adjusts instantly. It's a self-optimizing system that keeps itself in prime condition in real time. The idea of constant maintenance is fading away. If you're loving this deep dive into the tech of tomorrow, make sure you've smashed that like button and subscribed to Drevexa. We're just getting started. You might think building a motor this advanced takes a team of artisans, but Tesla has flipped the script. We're talking about automated machines so precise they assemble thousands of parts with micron-level accuracy. It's a dance of robotics that makes the motor lighter, faster, and ready for the masses. And the best part? It cuts manufacturing costs by a staggering 25%. That means the dream of an affordable Tesla isn't just a hope anymore, it's an inevitability. But here's the real secret, the one keeping engineers up at night. Tesla is rewriting the laws of attraction. For years, the entire EV world has been held hostage by rare earth metals. 90% of these precious elements come from one place, China. It was a chokehold on the industry, but Musk just broke the chain. The new motor? It runs on a design that uses zero rare earth metals. No neodymium, no dysprosium, just pure innovation. Think about the magnitude of that. These metals are harder to find than honest politicians and cost a fortune to dig up. Not to mention, the mining turns land into open pits of toxic waste. But Tesla's new magnetic alloy changes the game. It deletes the need for these dirty elements entirely. The result? A motor that isn't just powerful, it's genuinely clean. This isn't just about saving the planet, it's about saving the bank. By ditching metals that can be pricier than gold, Tesla has slashed production costs by another 25%. Less pollution, less waste, and a price tag that lets Tesla dive deep into the mass market. If you're loving this breakdown of how Tesla is saving the world and your wallet, do us a favor, hit that subscribe button for Dravexa. We bring you the future one update at a time. And there is a strategic genius here, too. Remember 2021, when exports slowed and the whole industry panicked? That fear is gone. With a motor free of rare earths, Tesla is no longer tethered to a single supply chain. They can source materials from anywhere, anytime, without political pressure or economic blackmail. It's total independence. Musk said it best. Our goal is not just to make cars, but to make products that are good for the earth. This is that reality. While others are still digging in the dirt for rare metals, Tesla has moved on. And the numbers back it up. This next generation drive unit is 20% more efficient and 30% cheaper than its predecessor. It's not magic, it's engineering unleashed. You can't see it, but you will feel it. The secret lies in a new electromagnetic layout that tightens the leash on power usage. In the past, energy would bleed out as heat, wasted potential. But this new design locks it down. It creates more torque with less power, launching the car forward with a ferocity that defies physics. You already know the Model S plague tears from 0 to 102 seconds. Now imagine injecting that DNA into everyday driving. This motor isn't just for the flagships, it's the beating heart of the next-gen platform, the upcoming Model 2. Lighter, cheaper, ruthlessly efficient. And here is where the math gets crazy. We aren't talking about adding bigger, heavier batteries to go further. We are talking about squeezing more miles out of every electron. Current models hit 600 kilometers. With this new drive unit, you're looking at 800 kilometers on a single charge. Same battery size, vastly different result. It's pure conversion alchemy. And when you need to stop, you're actually fueling up. The regenerative braking system has evolved. 
it used to capture 70% of that energy, now it grabs even more, smoothing out the ride while trickling power back into the cells. And don't worry about pushing it too hard. With a cooling system that manages temperature at the micro level, this is a machine that refuses to overheat. It's reliable, consistent, and practically bulletproof. Before we look at who should be scared of this tech, do yourself a favor. If you want to stay ahead of the curve, hit that subscribe button for Dravexa. The future moves fast. Don't get left behind. So, why is the rest of the world trembling? Because if Tesla pulls this off, an efficient, affordable, rare earth free motor at mass scale, it changes the fundamental math of the industry. It's a nightmare for anyone operating on thin margins. Take BYD. They are the masters of the battery, with the Blade LFP offering safety and cost. But that's a battery advantage. If Tesla can achieve the same range with fewer batteries just by having a better motor, the car gets lighter and cheaper. It forces BYD into a corner, upgrade the tech, or slash prices until it hurts. Then there's Toyota. They've bet the farm on hybrids, reliable, economical, safe. But if a pure EV becomes cheaper and drives further, the hybrid argument starts to crumble. Toyota is banking on solid-state batteries for the long game, but Tesla's motor evolution is accelerating the timeline today. They have to move fast or risk being left in the dust. And look at Hyundai and Kia. Their eGMP platform is brilliant, boasting 800-volt fast charging and great design. But here is the trap. If Tesla resets the cost benchmark, can they keep up? They have the tech, but can they match the price without sacrificing the performance? The board is set, the pieces are moving, and Tesla just made a move that could checkmate them all. You saw the headlines. Ford and GM didn't just adopt a plug, they bent the knee. The NACS connector is now the law of the land, proving Tesla's ecosystem is the new gold standard. But if the charging war is over, the efficiency war is just heating up. If Tesla's new motor resets the cost benchmark, the F-150 Lightning and the Ultium platform are in serious trouble. They need to slash bomb costs and boost software speed or get left in the dust. Especially in the world of trucks, where every penny of operating cost counts. This improved drive unit attacks the one thing that matters most to fleets total cost of ownership. It's a direct strike at the heart of Detroit's strength. And while the competition sweats over supply chains, Tesla is cutting the cord. By ditching rare earth magnets, they've immunized themselves against price spikes and shortages. Brands still relying on the old ways? They are walking a tightrope. One supply shock and their pricing crumbles. This motor-first approach forces everyone to adapt. BYD's cost edge? Threatened. Toyota's hybrid safety net? Torn. Hyundai's 800-volt advantage? Challenged. The benchmark has moved, and the scramble to catch up is on. Elon Musk calls it Master Plan 3, but it's really a total reset. The vision isn't just about making cars, it's about ending the era of combustion for good. First, they proved EVs weren't boring. Then they proved they could be mass-produced. Now comes the kill shot, making them so efficient and affordable that gas cars don't just lose, they vanish. Musk laid it plain and simple. Half the cost, twice the efficiency. This isn't a tagline, it's a warning. The next two years are about stripping away the excess. We're talking about a platform so lean and a motor so cheap to run that it forms the backbone of everything coming in 2026. It's the dawn of the next-gen drive unit. This is the engine behind the mystery. The same heart beating inside the updated Cybertruck and the refreshed Model 3 will power the holy grail, the $25,000 Model 2. No rare earths fewer parts, and a price tag that opens the door to the ordinary person, not just the rich. It's the people's car of the electric age. And for the Cybertruck, it means more range and towing power without the weight penalty. It's the same tech, scaled for different beasts. Before we reveal the factory that makes this possible, make sure you've subscribed to Dravexa. You don't want to miss the future being built in real time. 
Here is the strategy. One motor, endless applications. By using the same design across three or four models, Tesla isn't just building cars, they are printing them. It simplifies the line, cuts the maintenance, and decimates the cost of spare parts. And where does this magic happen? The new Gigafactory in Mexico, a place where automation hits warp speed. We are talking about one motor produced every 45 seconds. It's not just manufacturing, it's a revolution on a conveyor belt. So here's the bottom line. 2026 isn't just a model year, it's a tipping point. We aren't talking about a new bumper or a shinier screen. We are talking about a shift that rewrites the script for the entire industry. A time is coming where electric means cheaper, faster, and tougher than anything with a gas tank. This is the dream of the reset. A future where every driver, every nation, and every CEO has to bend the knee to the standards set by Tesla. But the question hangs in the air. What does the world look like after the motor drops? Does the game change or does it end? If Tesla floods the streets with this tech, the competition faces a brutal reality. Why buy a Ford or a Toyota when the Tesla is faster, goes further, and costs less? It's a checkmate in slow motion. BYD, GM, Hyundai, they don't just need to improve, they need to evolve. If they can't match this efficiency, they simply can't compete. Will Musk hoard the secret? History suggests otherwise. He opened the superchargers, making the NACS the law of the land. Who's to say he won't open the vault on the motor, too? If this design becomes the blueprint, we aren't just looking at a Tesla victory, we're looking at a universal standard. Today, it's a proprietary edge. Tomorrow, it could be the heart of every EV on the road. And here is the impact you don't see on the speedometer. It's about the planet. The math is simple, but devastating to the old way of thinking. 25% more efficiency means 25% less electricity needed to move you from A to B. That takes the weight off the grid. Less strain means less coal burned, less gas fired, and cleaner air for everyone. It's a win for the wallet and a lifeline for the world. Fast forward 10 years. Millions of these motors are humming on the highways. We're looking at slashing carbon emissions by 40 million tons a year, erasing the pollution of an entire country. By 2035, the roads could be silent and clean. The race isn't about zero to 60. It's about distance per watt. It's about who can go the furthest on the least electricity. Tesla has fired the starting gun. The only question left is, is this the masterstroke that ends the debate forever? Tell us what you think. Is the industry ready for the reset? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And to stay ahead of the curve in this electric revolution, make sure you've smashed that like button and subscribed to Drivexa. We'll see you in the future.